So he went that way. So I'll go the opposite way, I guess. Jesus Christ! Hello and welcome to Lost the Manual. Today we're playing At Dead of Night. Uh, I'm going to show you guys a quick intro video of what actually is going on first, and then we'll reconvene here and we'll start playing. Alright, see you guys soon. Enjoy. Already spooky. Already very spooky. Jimmy. Hello? Maya, it's Hannah. Hannah, where are you? You all went off and left me behind. Where are you now? What's this number? We're all booked into the hotel up the road. How far away are you? I don't know. I'll have to call when I get there. You can't. There's no signal. Well, it doesn't matter. Just go to bed, Hannah. Well, listen, make sure you're not Never a good sign. So we're playing as Maya, apparently. Jimmy, Jimmy is the proprietor. Jimmy Hall. Ah, Maya, I presume. Uh, oh, don't be alarmed. Uh, your friends booked you in. Uh, let me just check. Ah, yes. Uh, room 101. It's all been paid for, so you don't have to worry about anything. You are very nice friends. Very nice. And there's uh, quite a few of you I see as well. Nice to see so many fresh, young faces. <laughs> For a change. Uh, you're here for the music festival in town, I presume? Yeah, we were supposed to be camping there tonight, but... <laughs> There's hardly weather for that, is there? <laughs> uh, will you be staying for breakfast? I don't think so. We'll probably just get going. That's fine. And uh, if you don't mind me asking, Maya, would you be interested in uh, the entertainment tonight? Tonight? Uh, starts around midnight, usually. It's... it's me doing it, actually. Comedy. I do this comedy character called uh, Hugo Punch. He's sort of this comedic sociopath. Says things that you're not supposed to say and that sort of thing. It's quite popular with students. I don't think so. We're all just going to bed, I think. Are you sure I can't twist your arm on this? It's okay, I'd rather just go to bed. Sorry. Fine. 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 Which way are the rooms? Um, just take the lift. Uh, you're on the first floor. Okay, thanks. Oh, and, and then drop your key off in the box, uh, if you will, Maya, please, tomorrow. Okay. <laughs> Best show in town and no takers. <sighs> Who needs... Proper entertainment when you've got YouTube and my face or whatever. Stupid, uncultured. You don't like rude children. They're naughty. Don't start this again. I don't want to hear it, okay? Not tonight! Naughty children are bad eggs. They need to be taught a lesson. Shut up! Just shut up! You always do this! They're paying customers! They haven't done anything to you! Just leave them alone! 
Bad eggs need cracking, whack them hard and crack the shell, kick them down the stairs to hell. You know what you need to do, Jimmy. Show them who's boss. That's the way to do it. <laughs> Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> this is bad. <laughs> That's it. Go to sleep. What? Well, that works. Yeah, dark past all right. Oh my god. Alright, welcome back. Uh, we're going to start playing now. So, first and foremost, this game looks beautiful. Uh, it is... So, at Dead of Night actually uses active recordings in order to make it this sort of real-life experience. Uh, we're playing as Maya, the character you saw in the video earlier. It seems like we're trying to rescue our friends as well as escape Jimmy Hall, the psychotic owner. It seems. Uh, apparently there are also ghosts we need to seek out, talk with, and get some lowdown. Uh, only then can we possibly escape, apparently. But for now, I think we gotta kind of just figure out what's going on. So it is a point-and-click style. Um, all I know is that Jimmy is actively trying to get you when you're on the floors 1, 2, or 3. I think if you're in the basement ground floor or stairwell he can't reach you thank god for that some respite um but yeah we're gonna have to find our way around here so spirit box can detect spirit voice if you're near enough to them if you haven't seen it go watch the tutorial nah i'm good i need to find a compass and scrying mirror okay call out to jimmy that sounds terrible i don't want to do that all right so let's see. Well, the door was with a try, right? <laughs> Definitely want to get out of here. So there's a kitchen. Yeah, I feel like most of these are going to be locked. What is that drawing on the left? What are these drawings? Like a Jekyll and Hyde. It's probably Jimmy in that weird mirror thing he was talking to. That's probably Mommy Dearest, who's long dead now. Creepy. Is this one also locked? Okay. So these doors are all locked. There's a kitchen there. So we got the master key, which was good. We can use that to get into rooms, apparently. Like he can. Um, let's check over here real quick. What is that? Oh, it's an arcade area. That's cool. Time crisis. That's a, that's a good pick for a hotel. Wasn't broken, maybe uh, usable. 
Can I use it? Why is there an arrow forward if I can't use it? That's too bad. Alright, this is a little dark down here. Locked. Okay. Too dark. Okay. So, I think we're currently on the ground floor. Let's head to the basement to start. Try to get some uh, information. Are these unlocked yet? Okay, so ground floor stairwell is available. Hello? Alright, well, someone's down there. Alright, well, if the door's locked there, we'll just take the elevator real quick. Let's get back to the elevator. I'm assuming that works. Uh, that one's out of order. This one does work. Good. What if he was just in here, like, right now? Okay. <laughs> I hope he can't. That'd be horrible. Okay. So we're headed to lower ground level. We just heard a little girl crying. Let's go find her. Oh. Everything is like very loud and feels like you're there because it looks very, very real. Hello? Hello, little girl. Uh, can I open this? I guess not. And I can't enter the lockers, apparently. Yeah, this is locked beforehand. Well, it's gonna be locked still. Makes sense. Old arcade games. Alright, well... We heard her, but we didn't find her. Um, is she a ghost? Start conversations with spirits by asking introductory questions. If there are no replies, there are no spirits around. A loud noise means there's a spirit in a high energy state near. Well, it sounds like it's a high energy state, my god. Is anyone there? Okay, I guess not. We'll come back later. Maybe it's just not usable right now. I don't I don't really know what's going on with that. But um we were at the ground floor. Let's go to floor one. Cause ground floor was loose useless and lower ground is also useless. Oh okay. Okay, so she is down there. Alright. Well when I tried talking to you didn't didn't say anything. So we're gonna go back to lower ground. I noted a girl in the basement. Yes, yes, I absolutely did. There is a girl in the basement. Okay, will she talk now? Though? That's the question. Is someone there? There she is! Excellent. Try to make contact, try to confirm identity. What's your name? What is your name? I'm Amy Bell. Amy Bell, okay. Little girl, 10 years old. That's sad. She's dead. Ask spirits about the things you've seen. You'll see replies when there's like an item, okay. I saw a girl in the basement crying. Who was she? Jimmy, you asshole. So this is probably... I hope this... A boy named Jimmy... This was years ago then. This is not... This is not recent. So she died a long time ago, huh? Uh... Alright, so I have nothing else. I need to find a compass and a mirror. Okay. 
So I guess we have to go find the compass in a mirror and figure out what's going on. Because I have no other options to talk to her. We'll start with floor one. I don't know when Jimmy's supposed to actually show up. I guess we'll figure that out as time goes on. That's creepy. I don't like these balloons. Honestly, the point and click style is kind of terrifying as well. I'm not going to lie. There's a radio. Listen here. The storeroom. What is that? Okay, we've got demons and symbols. Move into the room. I can't take anything. Okay. Okay. One seventeen. I want to start on the one hundred one side. I want to work my way up. I think my room is one hundred one, isn't it? Where's my room? Okay, nothing's there. Oh, this is terrifying. I don't like these angles. I don't like these, like, corner searches. Which room is this? 106. Another storeroom. Okay, so it seems like if the doors don't have numbers, they're storerooms. Which apparently don't do a whole hell of a lot right now. Because I don't find anything in them at all. There we go. 101. This is my room. This is Maya's room. Let's move in here. Oh, I can hide. That's cool. If I need to hide. My book bags and stuff. You found a syringe and a bottle of diazepam medicine. Is that mine? No, that doesn't make sense. I found a storeroom key. Okay. Well, I mean, you found some bottles of whiskey, other spirits. All right. To try keys, open the inventory, face the door, and select a key. Doors can be locked or unlocked with the right key. Oh, ho, ho, that's useful. Jimmy Hall is on this floor looking for you. Stay away from him. Uh. Why am I stuck? Oh, there's an X. I shouldn't see it. Okay. Uh, I don't want to leave the room right... Oh, can I use... The oh, I can use the spy glass. Okay. I mean, I heard him. I'm not sure how close he was. That sounds pretty goddamn close. I'm not going to lie. What does he do? He had a bat earlier, so you know, beat the shit out of me, like probably. Um. Okay, well I don't hear. I don't hear footsteps anymore. Let's walk out. I like don't know what to expect from this. He sounds behind me, so let's just go down here and go in one of these rooms. Jimmy, stop it! God damn it. At least I can hide if he does start coming after me. Oh! You found a scrying mirror. Reveals hints and clues when used in places. When icon is visible. Either by the door in rooms or on the ground floor kitchen. Okay. Use mirror to see clues about where to go or which items to use next. Well, that's helpful. Also, if you locate lost keys, compasses in the ghost box. Oh, sweet. I found... Did, I hear him, like, just goofing out around up there. Like, where the hell is he? I mean, we're in a corner room. We made no noise. He hasn't seen us. I don't think it's a problem right now. Let's use the scrying mirror and see what it shows us. It's Amy! We know Amy! Hi, Amy. 
Okay, 119. Helpful. She's gonna be aggressive. Sounds good. Oh, I can hide in the bathroom too. Nice. Alright, let's check real quick. Uh, so we're going to one, room 119. I don't hear footsteps. I think we're fine. No, 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 no. I'll shut open the door. Stop. There we go. He sounded so close. What the hell? Cloth covered in blood stains. Oh, I got the stairs key. Nice. No, don't do that again. I don't hear him. Let's go check out. I, like, it, this game major anxiety because I keep hearing him. I haven't seen him yet, but he is fucking terrifying. Ooh, 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 ooh. No, no, no. No, no, no. Here I'm, like, footstepping out there. Deadlock key 102. Okay. Okay, I have a mirror already. Nice. So, I'm in 102. Oh, I can lock it. Can he not come through then? Because we're both using master keys, but if it's deadlock, me, he can't come through. Okay, that's cool. Ooh, dark room, not cool. Dark, alright. Alright, I still need to get to room 119, so let's go find that one and not get caught by Jimmy, apparently. I don't really know what to expect out of this. I don't like how it turns corners so fast. That's not cool, man. Okay, so we're good here. I don't like this. Hey! Oh! No! No! I didn't <laughs> press that! No! He goes, Maya! <laughs> Fuck that shit. Yeah, well, I'm, I'm hiding out in here now, because I'm dumb. And called out his goddamn name. Does he, like, react to that? Does he, I'm sure he comes, but, like, how far? I mean, I gotta watch those clicks. That was way too high. Okay, he sounds pretty close. That's not great. So I think the footsteps are like a big indicator of closeness. Because I hear him, I hear him stepping. Okay. I don't I don't hear him stepping around out there. I think he's I think it's fine now. Ooh. I wonder if I can call out to him to get him to go past me. I'm like trying to figure this out because I, I haven't seen him yet, but I know he's nearby. He sounds so close. Come on.
Yeah, he sounds right there. I'm left to me. <laughs> He's so creepy. I see you. <laughs> I wonder if I can get him to go past me on the right. Because he's like, he's just like guarding that way out. I don't want him to catch me. Uh, don't open the door. What are you doing? I'm here. Oh, okay. Okay. So, okay. That way I'm not just calling him out in the hallway. What's that? Is he opening doors? Let's try it again. Down here. Hopefully he just walks past the dead end and I can book it that way. The hell is he? Where where is Jimmy? All right, I don't hear his footsteps. I'm just going because I'm getting tired of sitting here doing nothing. Six. Let's go. Okay, nothing in there. 106. So I have 102 and 106 key. That's nice. Listen for a sec. I don't hear him at all. Okay. Because before he was even like calling my name. I don't even hear that. Okay, we're getting close. I think it was what one is one sixteen I'm looking for. A wooden paddle, turpentine, the lighter. I hear him. One twelve deadlock key, nice. Okay. So we're finding some good items. I not hear him again. I'm, tr I'm trying to breathe because she's so loud breathing. I want to hear what he's doing. Oh my god, Maya, shut up. <laughs> I think I hear his footsteps. Yeah. Okay, I don't hear him anymore. Oh, that was... I lied. I hear him. What the hell? Oh, he's real close. So that's Jimmy. He lost his nice little hat. Wow, so he, he literally just roams the halls trying to find you. That's terrifying. I'm dead meat. Yeah, thanks for that. <laughs> I 
It's a good system, though. Her breathing and the music itself masks his footsteps. You can hear him talking most... You can hear him talking, but I think his footsteps are the most important part because it shows how close he is. Okay, yeah, I don't hear him. I don't hear him walking around. Okay. So he went. He went that way. So I should be checking this way. All oh, these rooms are dark, man. I don't hear him. Is this the room? Is this 119? I found the child's purse. Maybe that's it? And a storeroom key. I have tons of those already. I don't need that again. Relax. Okay. I think... I think that's what we need to find. So what's next? Is that just Jimmy? Or was that a guy with a mask on? What the hell was that? Yeah, Amy. I know Amy. It's okay. I'll come back to you soon. Relax. Oh, it is it's the purse I found. Okay. Ah. That's what we needed. Okay. So we gotta head back downstairs and talk to Amy about the purse. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Let's double check real quick for footsteps. And or him yelling at me. Coast is clear. Let's go. I lied. That doesn't sound clear at all. It was like the moment I walked out, I hear his feet stomping around. Jesus. Yeah, once I don't hear the feet anymore, then I'll be good. <laughs> no, you won't, Jimmy. Good luck. <laughs> Not gonna lie, a lot of anxiety. Like, holy shit. He's right out to the door. Maya, just shut up. Stop breathing so hard. Shh. Oh my god, Maya. He sounds far away. I don't hear his footsteps. I haven't been here yet, actually. Let's check that out real quick. Ah! Dark rooms suck. I wonder if he can hear me opening doors, too. Because that would suck. It's like every door I open, he's like, Oh, I know she's this way. He sounds far away, but I should wait for the footsteps. No, I hear him.
All right, we're good. I hope. Oh, wrong way. Right? This way. Oh, it's so close. Shut up. Jimmy, shut up. Where was he? Okay, so he just went to the right. Is that towards the elevator? Is he now blocking the elevator? I hate this guy. Come back? What was that cackle? Why? I still hear his feet. He sounds far enough away now. So he went that way. So I'll go the opposite way, I guess. Ah! Oh, Jesus Christ! How though? I thought, did I go the wrong way? Because when I came out, so he went right, so if I came out to my left. I don't even know. Was he hiding in like, this side of the door panel and I didn't see him? What the hell was that? Am I just in some random room right now? Seems like it. Where the hell am I? Look in the first floor store near the stairs for the device. Oh, uh, he took everything. Dick. Such a dick, Jimmy. It's like right here, isn't it? I think it's this one right here. Yeah, this is the yeah, yeah this is the weird room. Oh, cool, okay. Whew. Alright. Uh, did he take anything else, though? I still have my clues and stuff, right? Okay, I still have keys. The purses. Okay, cool. That works. Alright, well now I can just head to the stairs, even. I have the stair key. Helpful. Notes, stairs, floor one key, cool. Nice. Uh, go down. So I don't have a basement key, but I now have an easy way to escape him in case he's near the elevator. Um, again, I don't think he can come down to the ground, the ground floor, so I think we can just head on the lower ground. With no issues. Jesus Christ, though. It is like the weirdest cat and mouse game with him. And he's so scary. He's so terrifying. Oh my god. 
Oh, Amy, we're back. We can talk now. Is someone there? Hello, Amy. Is it Amy? Yeah, it's obviously Amy. Are you serious? Yes, I'm Amy. This thing looks creepy, though. It looks like some weird, like, Tesla torture device. Who did the child's purse belong it's to? hilarious. That's it? That's all she knows? I found a bottle of turpentine in a lighter. What were they for? I didn't know what they were until Jimmy showed me. Well, that's ominous. I don't like that. Where did the wooden paddle come from? Did he light her on fire? I don't know. Why is there a blood-stained cloth in one of the drawers? Why was there a collection of whiskey bottles in one of the rooms? I don't know. But children shouldn't drink alcohol. Right you are, Amy. They shouldn't drink alcohol. Where did the bottle of diazepam come from? I don't know. Alright, so we have the child's purse. The girl in the basement. We already talked to her about that. What is what is this? I don't know what this is. Um, I can right click on things. Oh, you set up a conversation. Match two replies to think. That's right. Replies you think connect to work out the spirit story. Pair citing replies with item replies for faster progress. Okay. So it was... Okay, so I already had the sighting, but now I have the item. I can pair them and get more info. When you said Jimmy stole things from you, is that connected with what you said about the purse? Well, yeah, she said it was. Like, of course it's connected. Yes, he took it when I wasn't looking and stole my money. Yeah, Jimmy's a fucking asshole. Oh, what? Okay. Teddy bear. Ground floor. Okay. Is she still here? Oh, so they leave afterwards. Okay, that's cool. Ground floor. We're in the safe locations, guys. No Jimmy here. We can, like, get some story in before he hunts us down again. Jesus Christ. Okay, it sounds like it's coming from here, and it sounds like arcade games. Stop stealing my things, Jimmy! You fucking asshole, Jimmy. You're such a dick, Jimmy. Is she here? Is it Amy? Yes, I'm Amy. <laughs> it's like hiding go seek. I gotta like find her again and ask her more questions. Okay. Uh, I saw you shouting to Jimmy yeah. to give your toy back. Why did he take it? Because <laughs> Jimmy's a dick. That's why. Jimmy is a fucking dick. Um, okay, we gotta connect things. We have to connect things. Uh, sightings and items. Okay, so... We know that happened. Anything that could possibly connect... So we've already done the child's purse... I, I don't think it's these things, but we did have turpentine lighter, and she said Jimmy showed her what it was used for. What you said about Jimmy stealing your toy, does that have something to do with what you said about the turpentine and lighter? You said my toy, but that's stupid in the bottom. 
Ah, we got it. Okay. First floor. <laughs> I don't want to go to the first floor. I don't want to see Jimmy again. Fuck that. Jimmy's a dick. Oh my god. I don't know if it's as scary as it is for you guys watching, but, like, when he whacks you over the head, it is loud and scary, and I I just jump. <laughs> like, you can't not jump. Alright, I will use the stairs, I guess, because I don't want to use the elevator for first floor. Okay. Let's use our scrying mirror and find out exactly where we're going. Yeah, I get it. He's trying to kill me. I understand. <laughs> that has not changed. I know that. Poor Amy. Burnt her toy. What a dick. 109. Okay. Circus clown picture. <laughs> yeah! That's cool, Jimmy. Okay, so we're going for 109. Something about the circus clown picture. I haven't heard him at all. I haven't... Nothing's happened yet. So this is one of... What? Oh, 16, that's why. Eighteen. Twenty-one. Okay, we're getting too high now. The circus clown picture. What the hell was that? I'm so close. Just leave me alone, you ass. God damn it. Trophies. That's cool. Just you yelling at me all of a sudden. Okay, I hear him walking towards me now. Hello? Jimmy? Are you there, Jimmy? Jim Jam. You don't see me. I'm in a room, Jimmy. That's bullshit. So you're a fucking liar and you're an asshole who burns bears, apparently. Oh, and, and supposedly kills children. That's even worse. But, I mean, burning bears is pretty bad, too. He sounds so far away. Is it? Okay. A sword? Can I use that sword to kill Jimmy? That'd be nice. Holy shit. It's gotta stop doing that, man. Like, fucking God. Jump scare Palooza over here. She's obviously in here. Jump scare my ass. Is it Amy? Yeah, of course, Amy. Come on. Yeah, it's me. I saw you holding a toy on fire. What happened? Who was that? 
Oh, probably different ghosts. Okay. Okay. Probably a different ghost. Okay, before I even do this, let's scry. Shut up, asshole. <laughs> it's so creepy. Jimmy, you creeper, bro. How who, how does he get to own a, a hotel when he's such a fucking creeper? And apparently a murderer or something. He's drugging my friends. Suit of armor. I've been there. Okay. Is the second floor guy again? Yeah, okay. Alright, so we gotta find suit of armor on this floor. Because I've seen it before. I don't remember where it is exactly. So, we're gonna have to dance around Jimmy on that one. But we can do it. I have faith in me. <laughs> Let's do a quick peek -see poo Jimmy! Hello, Jim Jam. How are you today? Is this like his fun? He didn't kill me when he caught me. He just knocked me out and put me in a room. That's what he enjoys doing. Tormenting guests. Just like hitting them. Oh, I can hear Amy crying. Oh, he sounds closer. Damn, I should probably wait a second. Jimmy? Oh, ooh, he's real close. Oh, fuck right off! What the fuck was that? What? Why? <laughs> it's very abrasive. My brain, like, just, like... Stops working for a second. Jesus Christ. I don't even know what you just said to me. But you're a dick. Who likes to pop up in front of doorways. Which, he had no idea I was in here. I didn't make a peep. He just, he's just going around, popping in front of little eye holes, being a dick. That didn't make any sense at all. He's probably doing that to every door. <laughs> Trying to scare me in different hallways. Oh my god. But you'd think if he thought for a second I was in there and did the pop-up thing, he'd open the door. Like... Why? Go away! Why are you still here? Jimmy! Stop it, Jimmy! Jimmy, you're a dick. Don't be a Jim Jam. Why the cackling, you fucking weirdo? Alright. No footsteps. Nothing other than my breathing, and I think it's Amy crying. So let's go. Yep. Oh, 
is... Is she in the room? Is she over here? Oh my you god. Can't do that. You're hot. My heart. She is trying to kill me. Oh my god, dude. It's so scary. Is it Amy? Uh I saw you outside a room. Okay. Something frightened you. What was it? Oh, well, that's obviously with the sword, because we saw that earlier, too. Who does the sword belong to? No. Jimmy had it. I didn't like it. So I right-clicked that. So it needs, like, an info thing first, apparently, before you when can When you said you, you needed right a doctor, it. but Jimmy threatened you to stay, does that have anything to do with what you said about the sword? How? Oh, it's the alcohol. She said children shouldn't drink alcohol. He had her drink like whiskey or some some shit. <laughs> some some shit. <laughs> I've, I've checked this already, haven't I? This is one hundred two. Yeah, yeah, I already checked this. Okay. Alright, let's see what room we need to go to next. So, we have the whiskey and alcohol uh, clue. We just need to find what room she's in. It's hide and seek with ghosts! Wonderful! One twelve. Sweet! Ominous hallway with picture. Sounds good. I will get to you, sir. Like, I understand you're on floor two. I'm not going near you, though, until I finish Amy's story. Because that's just how we do things. Ladies before gentlemen. Special girls who were forced to drink whiskey and possibly died of alcohol poisoning. Okay, so I need 112. Yes. I haven't heard of it at all recently, so I don't really know what's going on with that. Um, where is she? It's so loud! Why is it so loud? <laughs> Every time, bro. It's so bracing. Yes, I'm Amy. Yes, I'm Amy. I saw you drinking something. You didn't seem to like it. What was it? The boy told me it was medicine. It tasted horrible. So sorry. The tension. I haven't heard Jimmy in a while, so I'm like worried he's sneaking up on me. Alright, so I need to get the whiskey bottles. When you said the medicine tasted horrible, does that have anything to do with what you said about the whiskey bottles? Maybe. She told me to keep drinking it. It was horrible. But then I started to feel strange. <laughs> Amy got turned up. Jimmy got Amy all turned up. Oh no! That's a staircase. No! Well, that's not good. That's not like a good thing to show me. Fuck. Well, I, I know where I'm going. I don't even need the, the fucking spyglass for that shit. I'm going right for the staircase. Jimmy. I haven't heard you in so long. Leave me alone. Leave. 
Oh! No, Jimmy! No, Jimmy! Leave me alone! He knows I'm in here. He must know I'm in here. The fuck was that? <laughs> that, come on, bro. Leave me alone. I thought he was like looking like that because he was gonna open the door. That was scary. Fuck. I want to make sure he doesn't pop in front of the eye hole again. Like last time. Like he's do- Okay, he sounds far enough away. Go out. Turn left. Turn left. Go to the stairs. I'll be fine. Yep, I'm good. Whew, okay. So it showed me the upper staircase. Let's go see if she's up there. the hell is that noise? Spirits of the damned. Is someone there? Is anyone there? Is anyone there? What's that noise? Is anyone there? Wait, I thought for sure it should be top of the stairs. Okay, well I'm definitely not coming out now because it's only he was right there. Screw that. Uh, this is ground floor. Yep. Cool. Ground floor. It said I could use the radio, not the radio, the uh, scrying mirror in the kitchen, which I think is here, right? Yeah. There it is. Okay, what am I doing? I thought she'd be in the top of the stairs, but we're, but she wasn't. So where is she? Okay, Amy. Third floor. <laughs> He's just a happy guy. He just really enjoys Manhunt. And no one plays him anymore because he's an old creeper. So he just wants to play Manhunt with little girls. That's what he likes to do. Some people have problems, bro. Alright, so apparently I have to go to the third floor. I thought I could just go top of the stairs, that's what it showed, but maybe it didn't trigger properly because I wasn't up there? I don't know. So he was on the first floor, I swear to god if he's on the third floor now because I'm there, I'd be so mad. He must stay on one floor at a time, right? Fucking every time, bro. Is it Amy? Really? Now I have now I have to go up the stairs. You serious? I do not have a stair three key. Yeah, that thing is like there's a ghost. <laughs> There's a ghost nearby. 
Thanks for that. Alright. Call lift. Get in there. I want to go to the ground floor. Yeah, we're gonna try to avoid Jimmy as much as possible. I don't want to deal with his bullshit. <laughs> so we'll go ground floor, up the stairs, and hopefully talk to Amy this time. But I need to see that little cutscene first, apparently, because that was important. Oh, maybe it's the second floor guy. Knocking, I heard. Alright. Is it Amy? Yeah, I'd be shocked if it wasn't Amy. Yeah, it's Amy. I saw you at the top of the stairs, on the banister. What were you doing? Nothing good. I felt really light. I really thought I could jump down to the bottom. Oh, come on. No. Amy. What a shitty way to die as a 10 year old. Jimmy got her drunk and then she thought she could jump. That's so sad. That's so sad, dude. Come on. Yeah, we're gonna see her dead, aren't we? Oh, so sad, bro. I saw you lying at the bottom of the stairs. Aww. What happened to you? I jumped, but then it all went dark and I couldn't wake up. I can't wake up anymore. I don't know where I am. Wow, okay, I completed her whole story. Okay. Damn. Oh, that's so sad. She died because Jimmy is a dick. Well, sounds like there's more ghosts in here because of Jimmy, so I'll find those out. Uh, I will start those again next time, though. Thank you guys for watching this episode and watching Amy's story arc. I'll definitely do more of these videos soon. Um, yeah, this game is, like, terrifying and depressing <laughs> when it comes to the, the ghost stories. And Jimmy's obviously the center of it all, so we will get to the bottom of that later on. But thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video.